the club, in the streets, waking up. Yeah, always when we meet, something's still missing. We're still faking it. We pretend that we're good, yeah. Cause to me, when I love, when I feel, I don't want nobody to tell me to slow down. Yeah, we're still faking it. We pretend that we're good, yeah. Cause you know I'm feeling something's missing. No, it's not what I had wished for. Let's stop Let me feel your love again. Cause I've been running round in circles screaming out your name Just the two of us and we can stay up all night Kissing under street lights Doing what we want to Doing what we need to do Staying up all night Everything is alright Oh, I wanna be with you Oh, I wanna be with you Let me be the someone who can hold your hand I don't even know if you can understand If you guys have been following me on Instagram, you would have known that this has been a long, long, long time coming. Really took me so long to reach this point to be able to digest everything. It's not anything like super big or extremely new because there are so many influencers out there that have already done collabs with different brands, different fashion brands and so on. But it took me a long, long time to decide to do this because I really want it to be the right time the right brand for you guys so I know that when I want to do something that has my name on it I want to be 100% committed 100% proud of it and yeah we are here today so I collaborated with Lavette for those of you who don't know Lavette Lavette.sg is a fashion brand from Singapore so for those of you who only knew me recently you might not know that I started out as a blog shop model I would model for all these fashion brands that were online and we called them blog shops I actually modeled for a good three four years before I became an influencer full-time so I would say that was the starting point of my career Lavette was one of the brands that I used to model for. I would say I was one of like their resident models and they were one of my resident clients as well and a lot of you guys would recognize me from there as well. We really saw each other grow from the very very beginning and I can't be any more proud. I'm no longer modeling for them but we still keep in contact. Jermaine and I, the founder, we still keep in contact and uh, we still meet up to try to find means and ways to work together despite being in completely different phases in life right now. It's such a heartwarming feeling to see how our friendship has evolved, our businesses have evolved and how we have come full circle but this time not as a model and brand kind of relationship but rather to come up with something really to call our own and um, you know I 100% fully trust the vet and I know their working style, I know the quality of their clothes and I really like that our styles are so similar. In fact, a lot of the pieces that I wear on my Instagram are from Levette, so I know that it would be with a brand that I truly love and I saw from the very beginning how they grew. So yeah, this is how the collection came about. Honestly, there was no inspiration behind this entire collection because this being my first ever capsule collection, I just wanted to make something that my followers would wear that is nice, that I personally love, that is accessible and is also versatile for every occasion. I'm actually really girly, I like floral prints but sometimes I also really like ruffles and at the same time sometimes I like chic clothing as well. So the theme was what would Mong wear and I just made clothes out of what I personally would wear. I was 100% involved in the designing, the choosing of material, the fitting, everything. 
of this entire collection and I am so proud. Finally, it took us seven months. I just wanted to make sure that this collection was good enough to be ready to put out on the market because I didn't want something to just be like quickly push out on the market just to make that few bucks, you know? Like I really just wanted it to be something that I'm proud of and something of good quality for you guys. We revised drafts after drafts. I needed the fit to be 100% good. A lot of girls who are my size find it really, really hard to find clothing that would fit them. So fit was so important to me and I really revised like up to 10 times for some of the pieces that I'm gonna show you guys in a bit. In this collection, I have 16 designs and uh, we are splitting it to two collections. So the first collection is gonna be launching on the 1st of December on lavet.sg and that is gonna be 7 p.m. Singapore time and that is GMT plus 8. So if you're from somewhere else, they do ship worldwide. The second collection is gonna be launching a week later on the 8th of December, the same time. Sincerely, sincerely hope you guys will like this collection as much as I do, that it would bring you joy as much as it brought me. So. I'm gonna talk about every individual piece and I'm gonna show you guys how I would wear them and some behind the scenes of the shoot we did in Bali and also add in some small little snippets of the lookbook of how I would style them. So let's get started. The first one is this particular piece that I'm wearing right now. I love this. I think if I really have to choose my favorite piece, it would be this uh, design. It has Swiss dots, details. It's just a very, very beautiful, very, very classy piece. So this design comes in both black and white. It has a really nice kind of tie string detail at the back. Really beautiful ruffled sleeves and I really like the entire silhouette of it. When I was designing it, I just kind of imagined it to be dressed down version of Tinkerbell. Something that is more like fairy-like but at the same time still wearable. I would imagine wearing this to a dinner date or a wedding party. We also made it in the signature Levette floral prints. So this is one that I really really love. So it's the exact same design but look at how when I put it in floral print it just became so much more girly and sweet. This is in a very beautiful lilac color and uh, it has the same tie string details at the back and it also comes in white. So this entire collection is really really girly. Just really love how the florals flow down on my skin. It's so soft, the material is really good, it's not sheer at all. Just really gorgeous for a day out, for brunch with your girlfriends and I just love it. Speaking of florals, I also have this maxi dress that I absolutely love. So this maxi dress is called Katie and it comes in two colors. One of it is a really beautiful blush pink shade and another one is white as well. I really love how it flows down and how it singes the entire silhouette really nicely. I made sure that the ruffles were flattering to any body type and once you wear it, you would just feel instantly longer, taller. The ruffles are not too over the top. They are really, really soft all across your chest area and it kind of flows down to the side of the entire dress. Once you walk, it also kind of opens up a very nice slit hole for you to walk easily and you can peek a little bit of your legs out. These dresses also come with adjustable straps like this. Next up, I also have a really beautiful dress. So when I was designing this, I really wanted something in the collection that could bring me to work as well. For this, I decided to come up with a piece that was really sweet. I like to call this kind of neckline the snow white neckline because it really shows off your collarbones and uh, it shows off your chest area but at the same time, it's not too cleavagey because it has elastic bands at the side which allows you to just cinch everything tightly together. You can always pull it up. You don't always have to wear it down as an off shoulder. Length of it is not too short so that's why it's appropriate to wear it for work and we have this little ribbon that you can tie at the side that allows you to cinch up your waist and give you a little bit more shape. Um, it's not sheer at all and there are two shades. One of it is navy and one of it is white. I feel like navy just instantly gives a more brighter complexion and white just gives you that really pure sweet look. 
Next up, we have Adena, one of the hardest dresses to make. We really did a lot, a lot of revision, to and fro, to and fro, and to be honest, it took seven months mostly because of this particular piece. Every single piece is kind of like hand sewn, especially with the floral detail along your neckline because I wanted it to kind of sit very nicely to piece up an entire neckline using the floral lace pieces. Really wanted this dress to be so good kind of elegant, more Korean-ish, which is my vibe, but at the same time also something that uh, all ages can wear. So even if you're in your teenage years, your mid-20s, your late-20s, your 30s or your 40s, you will be able to wear something like this and it will all still look so elegant on you. One thing I'm really proud of is the quality of this because I made sure it's not scratchy on your skin um, and I made sure that it's not sheer as well. Because this was so difficult to make, I think we're gonna have a hard time doing back orders for this one. So if you are interested in this particular piece, I would recommend you to hurry go and grab it. There are two colors, white and black, because I feel like these two colors really give off two very distinct looks. So the black one is slightly more sexy and sultry, whereas the white one kind of exudes a more pure Korean fair skin sweet girl vibe. I love both the same because they're just so different. The next dress that I'm going to talk about is Arcadia. Kind of Muji vibes, so a very simple, clean and statement dress that can be worn all year round and in different occasions. You know, especially with the cream version, it has very beautiful wooden buttons and I just feel like it brings a very humble and down-to-earth kind of feel to this particular piece. What I love about it is also the puffy sleeves that really gives you a little bit more shape, a little bit more elegant um feel. I just thought like this dress needed a little bit more like push factor to make it something different that you don't already own in your wardrobe. And this is three quarter length. I feel like midi dresses are really sweet and dainty. We intentionally made this slit over here to make sure that you know the entire silhouette kind of ties in together and that you get a very nice hourglass figure without showing too much even when you're walking. The material is also really really thick and good and uh, it comes with a back zipper and also comes with a sash uh, in the middle which you can choose to tie at the front or at the back. And this one also comes in black so there are two colors. Moving on to the next dress, I have Lisella here for you guys. A really fun uh, dress that I got inspiration from Coachella, in fact, because I really love the Coachella vibes, but unfortunately, it's not practical to have that vibe and wear it as every day, you know? I decided to take a little bit of that bohemian vibes and translate it into this beautiful dress. Not a lot of you guys are very confident about showing a lot of skin. I wanted to create this bohemian vibe using these crochet details just on the front and in the middle of the dress. The waist portion is actually see-through so you get a little bit of skin but it kind of gives a little bit of a break in between the illusion of your top and your bottom. I just love the trumpet sleeves as well. So the trumpet sleeves are three-quarter length and it also has these see-through eyelets in there that allows you to show a little bit of skin. This green was quite a big risk I had to take because I don't really really wear green that much anymore. It's like a pastel green that is not too neon. If you have tan skin or if you have fair skin, you will be able to pull this green off. I also have this dress. I love, 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 love this dress. We actually designed the graphic prints ourselves and we printed it on these fabrics. So this is actually really quite stretchy. I wanted it to hug the body at the right places. I also intentionally made the upper body part a little bit shorter and you know the waistline higher on the dress so that you get a very nice elongated long leg effect with this dress and because it's kind of like a circle skirt detail that is attached to it, you will be able to look a lot slimmer and the best part is 
This is actually a romper. Even though it's slightly shorter, don't worry because there are shorts inside. The pockets are so functional. They're not just like super shallow pockets, you know. I made it in three colors to suit everybody. So I have it in mustard yellow. I really love this. It brings a touch of sunshine to my wardrobe. Maroon red. So this one is like a slightly more wine color that looks a little bit more mature and like formal. And of course, navy that suits every skin color. I really love the prints of this. I feel like these pieces are very suitable for Chinese New Year as well. And same thing, it all comes with adjustable straps. I've got quite a few tops in my collection because you guys know me, I am a top and shorts girl. The first one I have is this top. This is actually a slightly cropped red top and I really really like the entire cutting of it because it's not too low cut. It's actually cinched very very tightly so you don't have to worry about a wardrobe malfunction but at the same time you can wear it off shoulder or you, know, you can put the shoulders up for a really nice snow white kind of silhouette and the floral prints I wanted it to be small but dainty but not too small to the point that they look like polka dots. For black the florals are actually brown white and green palette and for the pinks it is actually this color palette. Same thing, it is not sheer, it is double lined as well and you have a small little zip at the back that allows you to slip through it very easily. For those of you who love florals like me, I have this top for you. This is called Lilia. I just really love lilies so that's why I wanted to make a very nice and realistic watercolor print and print it on a very nice crop top that is really suitable for everyday wear. It is not extremely cropped, it looks quite nice and quite suitable especially when you wear a high-waisted shorts. It's just so feminine and I can just foresee so many ways to wear this. Same thing, it comes with adjustable straps at the back and it will look very nice when it's well fitted as well. So I have it in two colors, navy and white. The print kind of goes all the way. Good thing about this is that you will never be able to get the exact same piece as someone else because the placement of the flowers are always different. Next up, I have a really really girly crop top as well. Um, this one is inspired by the Coachella once again. I really love eyelets and I've always envisioned you know, my entire wardrobe to have a lot more eyelet pieces because it's very hard to find good quality ones. So I decided to create one myself. This is a really cute eyelet crop top called Hala. I really wanted it to be so cutesy and you know, something that is suitable for everyday wear. Even if you're just going to the market, you want something that is easy to put on, you know, look cute for the beach. If you want to go on a dinner date, you can just pair it with a nice uh, looking bottom. So this is a very versatile top with eyelet details as well. Just these are like ruffles and they're tiny ruffles so they're not like super big and like, you know, it won't make you look bulky. I made sure that they would make your shoulders and arms look slender. It also has a really cute kind of ribbon detail over here. There was a small little hole over here. It's just a small little tiny hole that honestly you won't even be able to tell that there is a hole. And uh, I am still able to wear a normal bra with this. There are two colors which is this gorgeous blush pink as well as white. I also have one crochet top that took us so long to nail it. It's called Deline. Quite similar to our eyelets, just that it's in lace detail and we also use the same floral prints, made it into a slightly cropped crop top. This one is slightly more structured compared to um, the other crop tops and I wanted, you know, some sort of a peekaboo with the ribcage area so over here there's no inner lining 
and we just made it there so you can show a little bit of skin but at the same time not too much if you guys know me you would know that I'm a big fan of slouchy shirts as well this time I decided to include two different designs of slouchy shirts in my collection and I designed them based on how I would envision my favorite slouchy shirt to be good quality slouchy not too see-through but at the same time maintains a really nice shape that doesn't swallow you whole so I have here Jolie which is a really beautiful high quality linen shirt what I love about it is of course the material it is linen so it is slightly thick but it is not too structured in fact it still remains that very slouchy feel to it you are able to create so many different looks with this you can put it down all the way to your wrist or you can kind of fold it up and give it a very military kind of slouchy look at the same time you can choose to decide how many buttons you want to unbutton and I like to wear it three buttons unbuttoned and I'll pull it all the way to the back to show a little bit more of my collarbones as well and that would give it a very casual vibe and I decided to make it in two colors white and also this kind of khaki sand cream color this looks really nice with forest green browns uh, cream, nudes and even black I think it gives off a very different vibe to your usual white so we have two colors for you to choose from next up I have Jules this is a really comfortable and soft material slouchy striped shirt i really wish you guys can feel this for yourself but it's so soft i just really love how it flows out on your body it's so so laid back but at the same time you can dress it up or down very easily just by pairing it with uh, a pair of shorts on dress down days or if you want to pair it with a pair of working pants you can immediately transform it into a power outfit very easily only comes in one color i tried to make it in different colors but i just felt like you know the entire feel of this slouchiness was taken away so i wanted it to be this very beautiful like blue piece the best part of it is the different stripes that has been combined to create this entire effect because these stripes are kind of like in different diameter distance between the stripes have been discussed over and over and again to make sure that you know it looks perfect this is one piece that I would love to wear next up I've got one romper when I wanted to do this romper I really didn't have any expectations on how it would turn out I'm so proud of it this is Kiara it's a very gorgeous kind of cross front romper that has functional pockets as well and it's quite structured at the same time it's not sheer and it's not too thick or heavy it looks very powerful quite formal but at the same time really elegant and chic so you can wear it to a cocktail party you can wear it to dress down Fridays at work um, because it's not that short I really love it I love like how flattering it makes my collarbones and my shoulders look but at the same time I don't show too much skin it comes in two colors black and white the two different colors really gives off very different vibe i was so blown away at the fit of it last but not least i decided to make a two-piece set a top and a pants this two-piece set is called edry i made it in two colors this kind of green as well as sand color and i decided to put wooden buttons as well in the middle there are four wooden buttons at the front this is slightly cropped but this is not too short uh, because even if you try to pair it with something else you will be able to make it work this one is also in a linen kind of material it has a very nice curved design over here that just flatters every body type i just really love how simple and yet structured and classy it is it comes together with a matching pair of shorts and the same thing it is tailored shorts a button at the front so you can put a matching button like this and when you wear them together they look really put together you can also wear them separately because honestly i chose them in colors that would match every other color and every other top that you own if you buy this set i think you can get many many different ways of wearing them love 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 the fit of the shorts i think it fits me so well because this is high-waisted and it really hugs the waist at the right area it creates a really really nice long leg silhouette effect all right
right, we've come to the end of the video. I'm so sorry this took so long. I'm so happy that this is finally happening. And I'm so excited. Honestly, I really don't know how this would do. Look at every single piece and I really fell in love with them. It just makes me so, so happy. So I will leave everything in the description box below. There are sizes XS all the way to L. So, you know, regardless of your body shape or size or skin tone, I hope you'll be able to find something in this collection for you because I created them for you guys. Do stay tuned uh, to my Instagram for more updates on how I pair them and also uh, on more behind the scenes stuff because I've been posting a lot. I sincerely hope that you guys will like this collection uh, that we worked so hard on and I will see you in my next video.